Live here on Franklin Street, police say at some point late this afternoon or early this evening, they'll send out a press release. But when you've got a little bit of a smaller department, it's kind of all hands on deck, including many of the public information folks who are out art here as part of the investigation as well. This is Franklin Street, not far from a rotary at the intersection of Franklin and Maine, where all the action started late this morning. Sources tell Fox 61 a couple of individuals were arguing as they left this market. And a short time later, a man allegedly fired shots, striking at least two people in or near this rotary. One sustained a gunshot wound to the abdomen, the other in a leg. Unfortunately, this happens all the time. I just, I don't understand why they do this, uh, but uh, it happens. That Norwich resident lives on Oak Street, several blocks from the shooting scene. I uh, stepped out of my apartment and I saw a guy running up the street uh, being followed by him a bunch of police cars and uh, people telling them to get on the ground and uh, don't move. Police sources say the male suspect was apprehended outside of this home at 16 Oak Street where residents apparently told him to get out of their first floor hallway. Initially, he was hiding behind the next door home, which has a ring doorbell camera and a resident whose identity we concealed. I was at the nail salon and I seen it on my camera. So I'm glad I wasn't home because I have kids here. Yeah, and she said to me, she confirmed that she, the kids were not home at the time. They were with her at the nail salon. Coming up next hour, we'll show you exactly where the shooting took place. Still don't know why, but as of last check, police sources say they're still looking for a black Nissan Murano SUV that was driven by a female who was with the male suspect when the shooting happened. We're live here at an active scene in Norwich on Franklin Street. I'm Tony Terzi, Fox 61 News.